I mean, oh my god, that is so good. So you might remember Suno AI, where they have a Discord bot that you can make these little songs with. Now they've had a really big update and you can actually use their new and way more improved model on their website. They actually have a web app now instead of just the Discord bot, which I understand a lot of people find annoying. So we're just going to take a look at what this thing can do now. I've generated a couple songs, we're going to generate a few more. Let's have a listen to this first one. I just typed in a country song about my dog stealing my truck. I mean that chorus, the background singing on that chorus. Let's just listen to that part again. With a mischievous grin. I mean, oh my god, that is so good. I'm really surprised how good that sounds. Let's look at the second version. You always get two versions when you generate a song. This is completely free, by the way. You get 150 credits when you sign up for free. So let's listen to the second version. I mean, that's really good as well. I prefer the first one. They're both amazing, though. I love the lyrics it comes up with as well. And you get a free piece of art that goes with the song, like an album cover, which looks fantastic, by the way. So next, I tried a rap song about the whimsical uprising of sock puppets against humans. And it seems to have a little bit of more trouble with rap songs. Let's have a listen. <laughs> Yeah, so I hate that. Let's check the second version. The land of the living room where the socks reside. There's a revolution brewing, they won't be denied. Sock puppets rising up, they've had enough of this tyranny. No longer just for coverings, they're breaking free. Sock puppets dancing on the hands, flipping in the air. They got moves that'll make you stop and stare. With buttons for eyes and felt for their faces. These little bubbles take it over all the places. Sock puppets take control, let your spirit fly. Okay, that was not too bad, actually. Definitely not as good as the country song. I like the album art, though, really good. Now just wait till I get to this last one, because it's my favorite so far, it's amazing. But next I asked it for a jazz song about the nocturnal adventures of a cat exploring the city at night. When the city sleeps There's a cat on the prowl Sneaking through the streets Okay, so I won't play the whole song, but it's decent. But yeah, it's a relaxing, soft, slow song. Now let's check out this last one I made, a pop song about the adventures of the skateboarding grandma. Now keep in mind, these are literally the only four songs I've ever generated in their web app. These are just first tries on all of these. I mean, you can, you know, regenerate them to see if they get better. Listen to this one though. Can't defeat. 
So I'm absolutely mind blown how good that is. I honestly can't believe that this has developed so quickly. Imagine just one year from now, how good this song generation is going to be. I think this could literally take over the entire industry within like five years. Check out the second version of the song as well. It's just so good. The background singing is what gets me. It's so, so realistic. So you can definitely see the difference between different genres and different prompts as to how good the quality of the actual songs are. So let's give it a few more tries. So let's try a reggae song about a goldfish with a silky voice that sings to its owner. And while that's creating, that only takes less than two minutes, as you can see. Let's try a few different ones while that's loading. How about an indie folk song about a zombie who becomes a vegan uh <laughs> sure all right here's our goldfish song i love the art again let's give it a listen Wow, okay, so it definitely got the vibe right. I do really like it, but it's just the quality's not quite up there. You can't really hear the voice that well, but it still sounds pretty good. Let's listen to the second version. Every day I sit by the sea Watching the wind, just you and me A little goldfish with a voice so All right, slightly better than the first one. Let's take a look at our indie folk song about a zombie who becomes a vegan. Once upon a time In a town quite small Lived a zombie with a conscience Breaking down the wall Risen from the dead but a change he had found No more human flesh He was going plant based now Yeah Beneath the moonlit skies He walked the streets alone Hunger in his eyes Hearts made of stone No more praise to feast on Had a new 
So it cut off there at the end. Actually, it cut off right at the start of the chorus. So that can happen sometimes. Let's listen to the second one. Okay, again it cut off there, but it was actually really good. I could do this all day, this is really fun. Let's make another pop song. A pop song about a talking toaster that loves to dance. Okay, let's see, pop electronic catchy. Okay, I really like this part where that little toaster comes alive. That was great. Sort of got a little bit worse towards the end. I think you see that more often. Let's try the second one. That was so good, that chorus, the, the music change, oh my god. This is really exciting and kind of scary to see where this is going to go. So let's have a look at one of these songs. You can actually download the video instead of the audio, which is interesting. Let's have a look at both. I'm not sure what the video would... Oh, so it actually has the audio, the equalizer bars going. That's pretty cool. So this song was 586 kilobytes and the audio bitrate is 128, which is not terrible. I mean, it's not fantastic, but it's not terrible. And this was a shorter song, as you saw... 
It can make songs of about a minute 20. That's what you'll see most often. I mean, if you look at the competitors of Suno, like Google Song Generator, Stabilities, it's just, this one is so much better. So as I said, you can use it absolutely free. Or if you do monthly billing, you can get the pro plan for 10 bucks a month. That means you get 250 song generations per month. The free one, you can still get five generations every single day for free, but you don't have the commercial license for it. And yeah, it says shared generation queue. I imagine this is going to get a lot more popular, so it might get slower than it is because at the moment it's actually really, really good. Also in the free plan, you can have three concurrent generations and in the pro plan, you can actually have 10 generating at the same time. The web app is really clear really smooth everything works well you can go to my clips and see all your generated clips where you can also favorite them and then filter on favorites only so yeah anyway i believe if you generate them in the discord they will still be on the older model i think only the web app has their new model but yeah we'll see where this goes i will make an updated video when this technology upgrades even more till then see you next time